Hi Gemini, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and to another You vs Them read. Gems, let's see how you're feeling now, how the person connected to your energy is feeling and what action we can expect in this connection. And Gemini, these are general collective readings, may not resonate with all of you. Please keep that in mind. Take what works for you, leave the rest. So let's begin. Welcome back all my subscribers and welcome in newcomers. So, Gemini. Okay, newcomers, I'm setting down two sets of cards here. One side will be for you, one side will be for your person. And in the center, I'm going to have your dialogue message cards, mutual energies, etc. If this is your reading, Gemini, you know which side you'll be, uh, resonate with, right? For me, for me, this is going to be person A, this is going to be person B. Bottom of my deck, temperance in reverse. The things are out of balance in this connection, Gemini. At least that's how one person is feeling. Uh, from the looks of the, the first look at the cards, I feel one person here feels, yeah, I got to know the truth. Uh, I'm not even waiting for an apology from them. Not that it's come. It hasn't come and I'm not even waiting for it anymore. My person now, I realize, was um, just treating me like a friend or friends with benefits or they had other people behaving like a player, basically. And um, yeah, this was a very imbalanced connection the other person is very depressed they're very depressed they're sad because I guess they know they lied they are feeling some bad karma they're feeling things are they they, they know they didn't do right I think uh, they are a bit afraid they are very overwhelmed with the thought that maybe the other person is moving on to somebody new now that's like a huge burden on them now so let's see what's going to happen I'm going to clarify these cards of course but first let's start with some dialogue message cards let's see if you guys could say something to each other what that would be and then I'll clarify these Gemini and their person spirit if they could say something to each other now what would that be Gemini and their person spirit. Gemini and their person. Thank you. Let's take a few more gems from another deck. Gemini and their person. If they could say something to each other now, what would that be? Gemini and their person. Okay. And just let me adjust the camera so you can see the cards better. And a few more gems from a third deck as well. Gemini and their person. All right, good to go, Gems. Let's start the reading. And if any of you are looking for personal readings, Gemini, my email is omkarataro at gmail.com. You can reach me there. It's there in the description box below as well. So the first card here says, There is more to this than I'm able to share with you right now. So somebody either didn't make their intentions clear or they lied or they were unable to speak their truth. Like saying, yeah, there's more to this that I'm able to share with you. I'm a completely new and better person because of you. We've come too far to give up on us. Let's start over. I'm working through issues with my family. Don't let the past dictate the future. I could never forget about you. I'm scared to reach out to you. I want to prove my love to you through actions. I want to marry you one day. You made me realize I had flaws. I'm trying to do better now. I keep looking up at the stars, hoping you're looking at them at the same time that I do. This lifetime didn't work out. Hopefully I can do better next lifetime. Wishing you the best, even if it's with someone else. I have a need to always be right. Sorry, I gave you a hard time. They keep saying you're coming back, but you're not here yet. Are you coming back? Why did you choose them over me? Okay, so that's been an issue. Person, one person feels they never chose uh, chose me. I was waiting for you. You didn't come back. You didn't apologize. You didn't explain yourself to me. The other person is, I think, very very depressed because they know they've done something wrong. So they're like, it's almost coming out of a sadness place where you know 
this lifetime didn't work out hopefully i can do better ne- next lifetime maybe there's someone else now in your life or something like that okay so let's start clarifying these cards here gemini but first an angel blessing card for you let's see what my angels want to bless uh, my gems with today blessing guidance advice or a message maybe somebody's got health problems here as well so do take good care of yourself gemini if this is you okay so because you know what happens is when you feel sad or feel emotionally upset sometimes shows up in your physical self as well so take good care of yourself just a little nudge from the universe so spirit tell me now what's happening in this connection let's start with person a's energy and newcomers these are just two soul energies for me i don't know which side you're on i don't even want to know because i want to be fair to both parties right uh, one side of course would be you if this is your reading the other side could be your love interest spouse best friend business partner could be a parent child dynamic maybe sibling i don't know somebody who's affecting your energy at this point and with these dialogue message cards i guess you've already figured out who this person is in your life um and when i'm doing the reading you'll also figure out which side you're on so right now put a focus only on one side which is person a for me so moon in reverse person a what's the moon card in reverse in your emotions feelings yeah person a f- feels yeah i know the truth about them i know the truth about them they they just wanted a passionate connection and nothing else they refused to make a choice they were not interested in a long term partnership and uh, there was no victory here i i felt that they didn't see me or see this connection to be a connection where we could have victory together in fact they i felt unseen in this connection they were not interested in a long term partnership long 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 term commitment and uh, here i was thinking this is a soulmate or something but no maybe i was wrong uh, page of cups in reverse page of cups in reverse in your emotions the moon in reverse again i think person a was waiting for some clarity maybe waiting for an apology or an or a love offer but they 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 felt unhappy they felt no uh, my person hasn't even apologized they're still holding back they're being stingy with their energy towards me then person a says yeah what i know is what i know then maybe that is the truth that they were never really interested in uh, this connection at all Uh, all they they had was maybe attraction towards me and nothing else so personally why do you feel like this tell me three three of cups in reverse what's three of cups in reverse three of cups in reverse yeah person a feels that the, the other person uh, in the pretense of having something to do with person a they were actually squandering their energy and giving the same amount to other people as well it was like yeah it was just not about me omkara taro they were giving me they were giving other people they were third parties in the mix and they were treating me like just an option in their life uh, person a says well the reality of the fact remains that maybe this person was just a player right uh, because they didn't even come back to explain themselves or apologize so well my truth is my truth I I accept now that they were just in it for a good time and not a long time and that's the reason I have now shut this down. I was carrying all that emotional baggage on my shoulders thinking this is a soulmate, this is a person who's going to come back, who they're going to apologize, they'll explain, they will see me as a potential partner for life, but no. I'm 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 letting this go. Now I'm dropping the burden. In fact, nowadays I'm not even talking to them, not even messaging them. And I know the reason why they are not messaging is because they are trying to still keep me emotionally hooked and waiting for them or being emotionally manipulative towards me. So, person A, tell me how do you see the connection now? Then, how do you feel about person B, and how do you feel about the connection? a uh, person he says uh, there was no partnership here there was no equal give and take in fact uh, they feel that the other person bread crumb them just bread crumb them give them a, just a little, little bit to keep things uh, stuck between the two of you and it was too small it was too little too less uh, things never really moved off the ground into anything 
higher or more solid and person they feels betrayed by that they feel betrayed they feel hurt they feel stabbed in the back by when they realize that you know i was just an option in their life i think person a has become a lot stronger now they are being stronger they have healed themselves they are taking their power back and now i think i think they're ready to make their own decisions and own choices now so what is this uh, lovers in reverse what's the lovers in reverse yeah person a says i've taken a step back to heal my broken heart now om kara taro and i i'm not even waiting now for any kind of apology from them or any offer from them uh i'm not really happy but well it would may have made me happier if they had come back and we had you know reunited in a very stable way you know like if they had come back with commitment i would have been really happy to reunite with them but i have been left here with nothing just sad memories of the past nothing really flourished here all those three cups which i thought we could use for our celebration with our friends they spilled to the ground just wasted a lot of time energy effort and that's it nothing fructified here so what action person a will finally take i'll open later gemini let's go to the other side and see how person b is feeling about this now so person b you have the four of cups in reverse as well what's that four of cups in reverse one more they're feeling like a fool now that uh, they never gave the offer or got the offer or things are stagnant between the two of you uh, they feel they they made a foolish choice maybe that uh, now they've lost out on a very very strong partnership they will never get it back they somewhere feel they don't have the clarity but somewhere they feel that person a has or is moving on to a new beginning for themselves maybe moving on towards new love um why is the ace of swords in reverse in your feelings and emotions yes they don't know but they suspect they feel the reason why person a has stopped you know communicating with them or is not talking to them is probably because you know what them sure they've moved on towards new, a new love already they've already started a new chapter in their life they won't want me back now um, they are not waiting around for me anymore uh, because things are stagnant i think person a is uh, feeling that by not stepping up or uh, you know offering something which should have been offered when the time was right i think person b is recognizing that they kind of cheated themselves out they got cheated themselves out of a beautiful connection this is like the king of pentacles queen of pentacles in reverse it's almost like person b says i cheated myself out of a power couple dynamic and that's what's making them feel in balance and this was the overall energy of our reading right so person b tell me why do you feel this way why do you feel that your person has already moved on or something justice in reverse because they know they they didn't do right person b i think feels uh, things were not made right and uh, they were probably supposed to uh, they know that they they know that person a was expecting some answers from them they know that person a had questions that they needed to answer to them but i don't think they did i mean they just stayed stayed trapped in their mind they didn't go forward and clear the air one more justice in reverse they i i think somewhere they were hoping they were they just kept hoping that the chapter would not shut down uh, i think this person just kept thinking overthinking stressing as to how to clear the air how will they answer the questions that person a has what answers will they give uh, i think in that much time i think they this they just stayed stagnant and wasted too much time and now they feel it's too late it's too late maybe person b knows that they got caught by person a uh, with certain things that happened in the past and now they didn't know have the answers which they knew that person a will want so instead of making a move and clearing the air this person just started overthinking about it and didn't take that action so ace of wands what's the ace of wands 
I think they are now scared. They are very, very scared. I told you, this person is now obsessively scared and thinking that, oh my God, you know, uh, because because I, I never really moved then. I didn't make things right. It's too late now. My person who's been single for so long and they're so attractive and so beautiful and so single, I'm sure they've already moved on to new love by now. It's too late. So how do you feel about the connection now, person uh, B? How do you see person A and how do you feel about the connection? Person B says, all I can think about is that they've moved on to new love, Omkara Taro. All I can think about is by now, I'm sure they've moved on. I'm sure there is a new love in their life. And the minute I think of that, I get bogged down. I feel overwhelmed. Why is that? Knight of Cups, tell me first. Knight of Cups. Yep, new love. That's what that the only thing I think this person is worried about is that person A has already moved on towards new love, new love, new love, third time over. Okay, so ten of wands. Why is that such a burden to you if they've moved on? They feel that my person A is not available anymore to and they will not want to work on them. Even if they were to now come forward, even if person B decided that hey you know I want to come forward I want to see you and I want to talk they are burdened by the fact of some stuff that went down in the past where maybe it was a third party I don't know but maybe things didn't work out in the past and they feel now person A will be the one to judge or decide or maybe now they have options so all person B seems to be doing is uh, spying from afar still thinking, still overthinking, still imagining, but not feeling very lonely as well, but not coming forward because in their mind they feel they messed it up in this lifetime. They're hoping that maybe next lifetime I can make it better. Yeah, they feel, um, they feel that the person A doesn't love them anymore. They've lost out on person A's love. Okay, so let's see what actions you guys will take then, Gemini. I'm going to take another deck for this one. And while I shuffle these cards, may I please request you, if you could just tap the like button for me, please. Helps the videos to circulate, keeps me motivated to do more videos for you. And uh, newcomers, repeating viewers, do like, share, subscribe to the channel. We welcome you in. All right. Person A, action from your end towards person B or otherwise. Three of Pentacles in reverse again. Person, okay, let's let's let, let's allow them to answer. Why the Three of Pentacles in reverse, uh, person A, as an action? Queen of Pentacles, Knight of Cups, <laughs> Page of Swords, Four of Swords, Three of Pentacles, Ten of Wands. I think person A felt that this connection was getting a bit toxic. Maybe they felt that person B was working with others, whereas person A always imagined that uh, they would be in a long-term partnership or something with person B. I have a feeling they are, they have healed their broken heart or they are healing their broken heart. And they're coming to the realization that, you know, first and foremost, I have to put in work towards myself. I have to focus on my stability, focus on my own life. Uh, it's almost coming to a point where they feel that person B was in it only for passion and nothing else and this was getting toxic. Um, I'm, I'm planning to pack my bags now. I have packed my bags now. It's time for me to move on. I think person uh, A only knows as much as they know because person B never really told them the truth. I saw that on their side. This Ace of Swords was in reverse. So person A says, I can only know as much as I know. And from what I know, this is what I feel. So the person is making their own decisions and saying, yeah, uh, if this was toxic, they hurt me. I'm, I'm healing myself, working on myself and accepting this is over. Okay, so person B, what about you? Action from your end towards person A or otherwise. Nine of swords in reverse. You want to come out of sleepless nights, but you'll have to take action. What's your action, person B? Four of wands, the lovers, five of cups, ten of cups, the empress, 
the high priestess and the ten of swords i think this person is still trapped in their mind i mean this is like a lot of overthinking i had the nine of swords eight of swords two of swords i mean like they need to come out of this anxiety and stress i think they're stressing more now because they feel person a is not stressing on them this person is just sitting in sadness and feeling bad and feeling you know that five of cups feeling that shame and regret and you know nothing really fruitified here uh, they look at person a as somebody they really do admire they love they want a future with but uh, somewhere because person a is not talking to them they feel it's over that person a has shut the door on them so i don't still see them taking any action as such except for just feeling depressed at the moment give me more uh, person b i'm not done with you yet uh any any action from your end apart from analyzing over analyzing nine of pentacles hermit four of pentacles in their mind person b says even if i went to went to talk to person a now even if i went and i wanted to speak my truth this person has been sitting and contemplating for so long they feel that person a is now single doing really well really abundant in their own life and does not want them back will hold back from them so it's not that they've moved on with anyone else they're sitting in their hermit mode just missing and feeling bad and feeling they missed out on an opportunity and it's too late now um yeah they they somewhere feel that person is already moved on to a brand new beginning they assumed it fear what what is it false uh but something something about false illusions or uh, false elements appearing real or something that's the definition of uh, I, i mean i could be wrong just put it in the comments whoever remembers it it's false elements appearing real or something like that that's where they're sitting at okay so why why the temperance card in reverse then spirit as the overall energy for gemini temperance in reverse why is the temperance card in reverse Ace of Cups. See, I've told you this is what is keeping the other person's mind imbalanced. Person B is because they somewhere feel person A has moved on towards new love. They've sailed away into their own peace and happiness and everything else, and they're sitting in that Four of Cups energy, feeling my offer will never be accepted. Now this is so much of thinking, stressing, over overthinking. trapped in their mind just assuming and presuming that person a has emotionally walked away from them and that overthinking is what is keeping person b totally stuck so that's what i have for you till next time then gemini love and light take care namaste